What's up everyone, Jake with Newmark and back with another Mix Academy for you. This time we're gonna look at a tempo transition trick that you can do using the sync button to take you from a lower BPM to a much higher BPM or from a super high BPM down to a low BPM, all, all while staying on beat mixed perfectly the entire time. So we have this track currently playing at 96 beats per minute on the left side. And we wanna mix in this track on the right side, which is at 127 beats per minute. Now, if you were going to try to pull that off abruptly, it's gonna be a huge tempo change for the dance floor. So what you wanna do is gradually mix into it. And we can do a tempo change transition using the sync. So a lot of online record pools will have certain transition tracks that they'll have pre-made going from one specific song into another but you may be out at a club or DJing a gig and you, you notice that you have two songs that you wanna mix and they're just, the tempo range is just too huge to mix any other way than this technique. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. 96 beats per minute is on the left side, 127 is on the right. So while this song is playing, we're gonna dial in this tempo using the pitch slider to 96.1. So I'm at plus or minus 8% on my pitch range, so that's not gonna be enough. So what I need to do is adjust it. So I can hold shift and press the plus pitch bin button. We're gonna go to 20%. Let's see if that will get us there. Not quite. We'll go plus or minus 50%. Now we're gonna bring this down to 96.1 or as close as we can get it. It was pretty close, had it. 96 should be just fine. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna press the sync button on this deck. You can see the sync indicator light up and we're gonna go ahead and press it on this deck. They're locked together and that's super crucial for us because what we're gonna do is start mixing this song in to this song and as we're mixing it in, we're gonna gradually move this pitch slider back to the zero point, which will take it back to its 127 beats per minute tempo. Since they're locked together, this side will also increase in tempo. So we're making a speed up tempo change transition where the tracks are still locked together. And there's the transition. So we're at 127 beats per minute, a nice smooth increase in tempo to the new track. And then from here, we can just mix in whatever we want. And that's how you do a tempo change transition using the sync buttons and your Mixstream Pro DJ controller.